Hi guys! In this video, I will show you how to create these crossed cornrows with top knot. I beginning begin with the part lines. First, you need a rectangle on top of your head. Next, I will create a small partings on both sides. Then I will spray some water to the another one and braid it. So three strands and then braid like that's braid. Left under, add hair. Right under, add hair. Left under, add hair. Right under, Add hair. Once I've braided few stitches to the beginning, then I keep on braiding without adding hair from the left side. As this braid is pretty small, it doesn't change how it looks, but this way it's faster and easier to braid when you don't need to handle that small sections of hair. Next, I will repeat the same to the another side. Again, some water before braiding. And as this braid is pretty small, I make sure that my hair is totally wet. Then just take three strands and start the braid. Bring the strands from sides alternately under to the middle and again in the beginning add hair from the both sides. Once you braid it few stitches, so the braid will follow the right parting as it should be, then you can continue braiding without adding to the right side. Continue like this until you braided the whole section in and a little bit more after that, so the braids will reach for sure inside the top knot. Then I will part the rest of the hair that is between these two braids. Small slices from sides again, like this. And then I split into the piece in the middle. Then I will braid the middlest parts. So take hair from the front and share it in three. And then braid again and that's braid. As this piece is bigger than two braids before, I will continue braiding like this until the end. So right under add hair left under add hair right under add hair left under add hair right under add hair and left under add hair keep on repeating Next, I will do the same to the other side.
Then I will part the hair sections that will leave between the braids in three. So here's the one, and then the second and third, and the same to the another side. Next, I will braid the crossed corners. So, take again three strands and start to braid that braid. Add hair from the both sides of the braid and bring the strands all the time alternately from side to the middle. Once you braided the first section, continue braiding without addings until this small braid will reach over the two bigger dot braids on the middle. And when you can add hair from the middlest small piece on the another side, then just start adding hair and braid like this. This middlest piece from the right inside the braid. And once you add it all in, continue braiding without addings until the braid will reach back to the left side. And now you add hair from the last piece of the left side, you can see that the middlest part from the left side is still open, so you need the braid first and the third piece from left and the middlest from right. And then we will create the same path as the opposite. So again, three strands and start the braiding dot braid technique. Bring strands from side under to the middle and add hair from the both sides of the braid. Then you need to only continue this until you braided the first piece in. Then continue braiding without addings until you can add hair from the right side. This time it's the middlest part. And yet, continue braiding until the braid will reach to the left side and you can add the last piece of hair inside the braid. Next, I will put all the braids together and a little bit some hair from behind of them and I will tie them with the ponytail and after that I create the loop, spread it a little bit and then I take the rest of my hair and spin it around a ponytail like this and then I secure the bun with puppy pins and here's the final result of this hairstyle Thank you for watching this video. If you like it, please hit the thumbs up for this video and subscribe my channel. Have a great day!